It seems like every year we get asked questions about the motor view in Parma, Idaho. This has been a tradition with our kids since they were little and we go at least once every summer, sometimes even a few times. There's something so fun about watching movies under the stars and as you know we have a big family so it costs us so much less to see the same new movies than it would at a regular theater. So today we're going to do a review for you guys and give you some tips that we've learned along the way. This time we went to see a movie the kids have been really excited about, Avengers Endgame. We arrived a little over an hour before the movie started and it was already pretty packed. There were probably 20 or so cars in front of us and within minutes at least that many behind us. I'm guessing this was a combination of it being opening weekend for the movie and rumors that the drive-in movie in Caldwell had closed. We just got word that one is open again, so we'll definitely try to do a review of that one this summer as well. Okay, a couple tips for you guys. First, you'll want to get there early, so bring something to do while you wait. Our kids like to throw around a football or play tag in the open area. It's also a chance to get our movie snacks ready. The concession stand carries food, drinks, and candy. There are also bathrooms and some seating in the concession building. Make sure to buy popcorn from the concession stand. That's my favorite part and totally worth the money. It's even popped in the original machine from 1953. Also, remember, if you have kids, it's a double feature. Our kids almost always fall asleep during the second movie, so we tend to bring them in their pajamas so they can go straight to bed when we get home. Also, don't forget your pillows and blankets and a jacket if needed. It definitely cools down after the sun sets. You may notice the yellow poles you park between. This is where the speakers used to hang until 1977. Now everything is done through your car radio. Just make sure to unplug everything and turn off your dome lights so you don't end up with a dead battery. But don't worry, they do have a portable charger at the concession stand, just in case. The show starts in one minute.